What's up, YouTube? Big Boy Designs back again with another tutorial. Today I'll be showing you how to do the a photo manipulation fire guide. All right. So what you want to do is open the tiger, the tiger picture that I gave you. It'll be in the link. No worries. So once you get that pulled up, you'll just want to go to your image adjustments and desaturation. I'm sorry guys if this is slow because I'm running I have it written down on a piece of paper and it's kind of hard to memorize this. I haven't got this fully packed down yet but it will be pretty clear to you whenever if you listen carefully and do as I tell you. Alright now what you want to do is go to your panel. I mean your little adjustment thing down here and you'll want to go to your levels. Now what you want to do is this thing will pop up and you'll just want to drag this until it turns pretty bright about right there and then this one just up a little bit and the dark one about right where about right there. Alright that's nice. Alright now you'll just click that and you want to go to brightness and contrast. You'll just want to click that thing again and go to brightness and contrast. All you want to do is just change that down to around 40. Or 45. Okay. 45 is nice. Alright. Now what we'll do is go to invert. This is the last thing I think we'll do is go to invert. And that'll make the picture look cool as hell. Alright. Now once you get that, you'll just go to, you'll just control or shift and then click the bottom and then you just want to merge them. You'll just merge all layers. Now you want to come over to your channels and hold control and click RGB. Alright, now all that will pop up, and you just want to go to Control C, and then make a new Control C to copy. So Control C to copy it. Then we'll just want to make a new file, a new file, and then come over here and change the the file width to 1290, and the height to. 720 and hit OK. Now this thing now it will pop up and you want to change the background color to black. Change the background color to black. And now you'll want to go to paste it. Now you just want to paste it to V. Now you just want to control V, resize it, and you'll just do that right there. Yeah, that's pretty good. Apply. Okay. Sorry, I'll just do this to get this thing off of here. Alright, now you'll just want to go to lock it. Now you want to lock it. I'm so sorry guys, but I really have to read it, I, mean, I have it kind of tight, so I have to look at it, alright, but now you just want to lock it, you want to go to your lighter yellow, light, lighter, light yellow right here, go to your paintbrush, and just, bang, <laughs> that was a really big paintbrush, once you do that, you'll just want to go to, you want to you want to change this to tiger render or whatever you want to call it but I'll call it tiger render and you'll want to go to you want to unlock it come over here go to blending options or double click it and then go to outer glow and change this to a good red to a really FF here's the hex code FF zero 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 so you can get the perfect I mean you can just go to red and boom but 
just to be lazy and about 50 you want to change the opacity to about 50 okay and hit okay all right once you're done with that you'll want to go to oh I'm sorry I'm so sorry that doesn't that doesn't really look too well you want to make it really bright you want to make it a hundred so now it looks crazy 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 tiger now you want to come over here to choose the light ye light yellow orange right there now you want to lock it again you want to go to your paintbrush I'm gonna lower the 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 size of the paintbrush just a little bit and I'll just color around the tiger a little bit. Sorry about that. I was thinking for a second. And just color around it. Alright. Once you, once you do that, you'll just go to... You'll open your fire. The fire will be in the thing, so no worries. Alright, now once you get this, you'll just go to... You'll go to your channels, and you'll just click green. Once you click green, you'll want to click the circle below. And then just click RGB again. Go to layers and just copy it. And then you'll just hit control copy and then control V right away. And then I'll just pull up that. Now you'll just take those down off and you'll just actually control copy and go back over to this. And then control V. And then you'll go to your move tool. Control so I can adjust this because it's pretty because that's pretty big and then you'll just put fire oh. you'll put fire all around the and then you'll go con command J or control J and just keep on posting fire Just keep on posting this fire. There we go. Right there. Then we'll just okay, apply. Control J. J. And then I'm just gonna put some fire over here. I'll just put a lot of fire over here. Oh, what the heck? Now we'll just do this. Just keep on putting flames. Just keep on putting flames to make it nice. Sorry that it's a little slow, but... It'll be nice once you do it. It'll be it'll look nice once you finally complete it and do everything nice and
complete. Yeah, just follow along. I mean, I'm sorry if this is a bad tutorial or what, but I mean, I think it I think it was pretty helpful if you ask me cuz <laughs> I mean, this is pretty cool. Now you'll just want now once you get all your flames around your tiger or whatever you want to use, you I mean, you can use anything. Actually, I'm going to just do a few more. Wait, control T, I got to shift it this way. There, apply, and then there you go. Once you get all that around, you'll just... You just want to make, forget to tell you, you wanted to make that a smart object. You wanted to make all these a smart object. God dang it. But oh well, that's okay. We'll just do it now. <laughs> we'll just do it now. Alright. Then I'll merge it and everything and then... Alright, now you just want to go to your eraser tool. And yeah, and you want to raterize it if you if you just if you wanted to do it right then, and you just erase all the inside. Not unless you like it on the inside, but to make it more professional looking, you just want to erase it on the inside. You like want to erase it on the face the mostly, but you can do anything you want because it's your picture. But this is just my this is just the tutorial I'm doing, and I'm just gonna cut all these down, just chop them down like trees. Excuse me. Right, see, I'm gonna just chop these things down like trees. Yeah, I'll just erase that right there. Actually, no, I shouldn't have. So I'm gonna just redo that right there, cause it looks kind of just brings a little bit of fire around there. And I'll just put a. L I'll just cut that off right there. And then now I'll just trim this last bit up right here. All right, now that looks pretty good. Now you'll just want to come, once you erase it and all, you'll just want to come down to a new layer and put it above the background. What the heck, why isn't it moving? Alright, once you get it above the background, you'll just, you'll pick the brush and you'll just want to go big, 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 pretty big, like that around, probably a little bit bigger, so I'm going to make it that big. And I'll go to, you need to pick darker red. So let's find, no, that's darker, there's darker red. And you'll just, and then once you get that big circle, you just click and booyah. And there, there you go. I'll put that nice, good background. Now you'll just, now that looks nice. Now you'll just come back to your tiger render or whatever you named it. Go down to your thing or thing and go down to levels again. And just you'll just wanna lighten that a little bit. Whatever you want, just lighten it. However you like it. I kinda like it right about right there. Alright. I mean that looks pretty nice and now I'll just make this a little bit bigger. Now you just wanna make this a little bit bigger. More red. That's just the reason. Why? It's because it's more red, and the red the better, I guess. Alright. And there you have it, YouTube. Nicely done. Flaming Tiger. You can do this with roses. Anything else, really, you wanted to do it with also. But, yeah. <laughs> 
I'm gonna just do a few things real quick to see if it does small changes. Small changes real quick. Small, small, small changes real quick. All right, levels. I'm gonna just brighten this up. Oh no, nope, no, nope, that doesn't do it. All right, let's go to midtones. Oh no, nope, no, nope, that doesn't do it either. Darken. Okay, never mind. Just there's your photo, guys. Like, subscribe, comment, favorite, and message me. Message me for more. Comment. Comment below to say whatever more stuff you want. Alright, guys. Thank you. Bye.